Hi everyone, here is Toy Hut. This is my first video on YouTube, and I hope you enjoy my video. I booked this Gorga set six months ago, and uh, finally I received it last week. Mm, here we can see the box with both Gorga and uh, black version. And personally, I do not prefer the way the market here. The market here. Uh, that looks exactly like Japanese national flag. I saw someone else's with an olive check, but uh, I have no idea why mine is red. Mm, anyway, anyway, let's open it. Actually, this box is already opened, and I found that this box has no tamper seal. Uh, it's just glued, and if you open it with less care, like what I did, um, it will be like what you're seeing. First, let's see the GM94 pump action grenade launcher. It can contain four rounds of grenades. The grenade is well made. And uh, the letters on it are legible. And the launcher is pretty much movable. You can move the gun stock, you can lock it. And here, and also here, like a shotgun. You can move like a shotgun. And also the mechanic aim. Three stages. We can put the grenade in, load it, shut off. Also, I love, I really love the worn out here. The worn out and here. Perfect. Now here we have AK-74M. Um, to be honest, I'm not very happy with the painting, especially on the magazines. For example, this one I have in hand, it has some defects like this. Let's see. Uh, these are caused during the caused by bubbles during the painting procedure. And uh, for the brown one, I've got some dot dots here. This is one, and a bigger one here, black one, dark dots. And also the white thing looks like scratch. But the gun, the gun is, I mean the rifle is perfect. Only this place is a little bit tight. You can do some polishing, hand polishing, then you can fit it in. And uh, the scope is nice. Different colors. And we have covers. Okay. You can close it. Movable mechanic aim silencer. Nice. Alton helmet might be one of the reasons that many collectors would like to buy this set. It is a very different one from the helmet with visor. Uh, we can see the first side of it gives me a sense of good quality. It has goggles, soft one, pretty much clear, and the one out here, 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 here. 
are perfect. So I wonder. This is covered by a fabric. I wonder what color inside. What color is the helmet itself? I'm gonna detach it. Joke, not today. Now fabric parts. This shirt, navy shirt, is a complimentary. It's not mentioned in the promotional poster, but still with good quality elastic. And uh, here is the uh, the sign. I believe this is FSB, FSB Federal Security Bureau. And the bag is well made. You can see the SRVB Elite Forces. Also, the Gorka is simple but well made. You don't need to do too much to、um, organize to get good outcome. It's just so natural. And、uh, the all the pouches are perfect. And,、uh, the two vests. Bulletproof and modular, and、uh, this is cool. I need to mention that the gloves, the gloves, have problem with、uh, peeling, so maybe it's better to use this the same、mm, fabric of the mask. This one doesn't peel. Okay. This toy has minor painting issues, as I mentioned before. I hope、uh, Super MC can minimize them in the future. And also, the pistol magazines are a bit long to the pouches; it cannot close. But I think this is okay. I personally love the grenade launcher; it's really amazing. And all these pouches are good fit to Gorka pretty well.、Mm, it it just、uh, the whole figure gives us a sense of well organized, cool, and bit bully tough Russian soldier. I love it. And it is it is equipped with outing helmet, which has been huge fashion. For Russian military fans and collectors, I am personally looking forward that Super MC would release various outing helmet kits.、Um, I'd say、uh, it is not、M、Super MC's first Russian military toy. It is not too modern or westernized. I'd say it is a、uh, transition to a new. Russian spetsnaz.